Recent Consumer Reports testing found concerning levels of phthalates in all fast food samples tested. Phthalates are classified as endocrine disruptors because they alter the release of hypothalamic, peripheral, and pituitary hormones. Testing found levels of phthalates ranging from 2,700 nanograms per serving for Pizza Hut to 24,000 nanograms per serving for Moe's Southwest Grill. Phthalates leach into the final food product from packaging, processing, and the plastic bags that many fast food restaurants use to cook food in. The phthalate levels detected in fast food items on their own would not exceed the tolerable daily intake set by the European Union. Previous consumer reports testing from January of this year also found phthalates in plastic package in canned beverages, beans, condiments, dairy, grains, infant food, meat, poultry, fruit, seafood, and frozen prepared meals. Based on my calculations, the cumulative effect of eating a large number of these tested foods would significantly increase your phthalate intake, but would still not exceed the acceptable daily intake. Even more concerning, their test detected the presence of phthalate replacements at concentrations 320 times greater. Little is known about the risks of phthalate replacements, but they're expected to have similar deleterious effects on our health. The level of phthalate alternatives could easily exceed the ADI set for phthalates. However, these are not the same compounds and we do not have enough testing to set an ADI for the alternatives. With that being said, no amount of phthalates are healthy or beneficial and should be avoided whenever possible. The best way to reduce our exposure is eating whole foods directly from local farms or with minimal packaging. I'm very intentional about the type of packaging I use on my products to ensure they don't contain any phthalates. All of my teas are in 100% compostable bags that are free of phthalates, PFOS, BPA, BPA, and PLA. It's nearly impossible to avoid all phthalates, so I don't want you to become overly obsessed if you're already conscious and take necessary steps to reduce your exposure.